Good morning guys, it's competition day one and I'm gonna show you how I get ready, so let's go. Seeing something is very important and then I'm going to wash my face with some cold water so I wake up and then I do put a little bit of makeup on. Um, so yeah, I will explain why. Um, well first can I do is put a little bit of day cream on. This is from ATOS, it's a very cheap one. I would love to use another one but this one is easy to take with me because it's just small and like the other day for my use is in a bottle of glass so it's just hydrating my skin a little bit so that's what I use not too much okay then I do take a concealer and beauty sponge and I know people always say like it's really bad for your skin to wear makeup um, while you're doing a sport because you're sweating and the makeup is really getting into your face. I don't have problems with my skin while wearing makeup. I don't do full face foundation, full coverage. So just a little bit of concealer under the eyes and on the little spots. Um, and that's just for my self-confidence. I do go out over the streets like this without any makeup on. But they do take loads of pictures and I know I will sweat this off probably. But it just gives me a little bit more self-confidence. So yeah, that's why I'm doing the lotion powder. I will just put this under my eyes so the concealer will stay in this place because if you wear makeup very sport it's important that it don't move away because of all the sweat and especially I'm putting a mask on so it's important if you wear um, makeup products that you use like long lasting ones uh, this one do stay good on your face it's from Maybelline um, I'm just using I never used it during competition um, if you do want to wear it like foundation during a competition you should use the Smashbox Studio Skin 15 hour wear hydrating foundation this one does stay on your face so this one is just great um, yeah, powder. so after power there is just one important thing to do and that's my eyebrows because eyebrows do make your face so that's something I actually always do So, um, next thing is getting my clothes all together. Um, I always have like a sport outfit, so what I wear under my fencing suit. But first I would just wear my Turkish clothes and long trousers. Um, during the competition I do sit in my wheelchair, I don't wear, use my prosthetic or anything. Before the competition I just walk on my prosthetic, so yeah. So, let's get dressed. 
outfit is on, jacket, shirt, Nike trousers, no spun, I wish I got Nike no spun it. Um, fencing socks on, prosthetic on, and that's it. So let's go downstairs. I'm going to get breakfast. I don't eat a lot. I will make other videos about what I eat before a competition because I'm going to change this pattern um, and I'm going to make a new kind of siri and I will show you all of this inside of that. So now it's just like getting ready and I will show you how I get focused before the competition. So let's go. Here guys, so it's um, one hour before we will start fencing, so it's that time to prepare. So what I always do before the competition starts, I will take my headphones and go listen to some music. Like I don't have like a typical music I do listen, so not classical, not hard style. Just listen what. I think that's good at the moment so yeah that's what I'm going to do and I would just try to get in focus doing a little bit of a warm-up to get my body warm so yeah that's it so that's what I'm going to do now